Welcome everybody to our Data Collector 2.0 video, this time Android Wear OS for the Sunto 7, for example. This is now a Data Collector version for a smartwatch where we add the move sense sensor as well. On the left side you see a Sunto 7 watch running Wear OS and on the other side you see two move sense sensors. We will now go into the application on the smartwatch so pressing the buttons go in there and here's now the data collector which we choose and within the data collector we can now add a project and with the project name that we add in we just take it's a little bit difficult sometimes to add the name so we just choose something then we choose next with the amount of uh, move sense we want to add. We take two. Please consider it's still a smartwatch, so the Bluetooth um, chipset is not that the best one. And um, then we choose linear accelerometer and uh, heart rate and uh, choose the frequency axis that we want to do. Let's take 104 hertz. And uh, now we have the project ready. We choose it. We choose the sensor activate the sensor, it works as with the other data collectors as well, that we bring it close to the device, it's connecting, there we go, with the first move sense, and uh, now we add the second to the device, and it's connecting now as well. Now they're connected and <coughs> synchronizing now with the record button, so when it gets the green hook and all the other data, it's done, and now it's starting already to uh, record the data. We can press on it uh, that you see that there's the, the live data coming in. The meter is it's moving and heart rate obviously as well. Um, on the main screen you saw the microphone sign and the text annotation. This version you can also add microphone audio files or also text annotations with hot buttons or text. Obviously for the uh, whereas version, the hot buttons are the most useful ones because you don't have that much space to use everything. So when we go out of the project, it's it's saved on the memory of the smartwatch. Now we just show you how you can edit the um, the, the sensor data. So you can have one sensor um, taking other measurements than the other one. So we just play a little bit around and here you see all the different uh, parameters that you can do. So you can take heart rate off and for this one add angular velocity and magnetic field. And uh, off we go to the project again. And within the project we do the same thing as before. We connect the sensors, first one and now the second one. Pressing record button, it's then synchronizing now, and now the recording already started. Here you see accelerometer, gyro, and magnetometer on one. And that's about it. Um, neat little device for a smartwatch and uh, to do raw data collection with a move sense sensor. We have some upcoming features for the smartwatch, obviously. Um, but if you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact us at kava.com. And off we go out of the application. Here we go back to the main screen. Thank you very much. And if you have questions, just put us an email. Thank you. Bye bye.